The other day, my wife came home from an art auction. She brought with her a little uh, objet, a souvenir, if you will. This in the form of a miniature samurai sword. Now, you, sir, have we ever met before? No. You just did the trick a moment ago. Check out the sword, if you will. Look it over. Make sure it's perfectly solid. And if I may retrieve it from you, I will tell you the story of this. You know, the Japanese treat these very much like jewelry. They hand them down from generation to generation. And it occurred to me that it would be nice if we could develop an effect where it was kind of east meets west, where we have the, the western jewelry and the eastern jewelry. And in the form of the western jewelry, if I could borrow a ring from you. Do you have one of those? That'd be great. Your name, sir? Shell. Shell. Thank you very much. Shell, the effect is a simple and direct one. In a moment, I'm going to attempt to make your ring <coughs> excuse me, travel from my hand to the sword. It will happen at the count of three, and you will hear it happen. Please watch and listen carefully. One, two, three. You see, underneath the foulard is a single ring impaled on a samurai sword. This is that sword. If anyone would like it, I will include the solid gold ring. Oh, no. Shell, I thank you very much for your participation.